with a minute nine to go. Burwell to the one. He stopped right there. The Ducks with one timeout remaining, and they'll let the clock run. I mean, it's it right here. The Ducks will have three chances from the one-yard line to take the lead. Unbelievable how the ebbs and flows have gone back and forth in this football game. It really is amazing, and, and they're trying to work the clock here where they don't leave any much time on the clock. You know, you're one yard away. They have a great line surge on their first play. They're one yard away, and this is the ball game. I mean, this, this yeah, is... Yeah, I'd say this is the ball game. Three tight ends in the lineup for the Ducks. Over the top is Kellamani, but he's short. He stopped short of the goal line at about the half-yard line. The clock continues to run, 50 seconds to play. Usually officials, when there's a big pileup, will maybe stop the clock. But believe me, if Oregon scores the way they have done it here, would be the best possible way. Timeout now. I think, just on stack them, I, I think. think they're just going to yeah, unstack just them. them. Yeah. So the clock was stopped at 41. Now it runs at 40. I really did think Calamani was in, and it looks like from there, he is awfully close, but just not quite. You go back to the same hole. It's up to the Oregon offensive line to win the football game. Stopped at the two. Maybe the one. Timeout Oregon. That's what wow. Arizona thought the Ducks would do, and that's what they did. 13 seconds left. And the Ducks use their final timeout. Wow, you couldn't ask for anything better than what we've seen. There's not a person in the stands or even in the press box that doesn't have butterflies in their stomachs with sweaty palms. This has been an unbelievable opener to the Pac-10 conference season. Good guys. I mean, unbelievable. Right down to the last, the last play of the game to see who wins the ball game. Both teams have a chance. It's just, just incredible. And, and it's you real. just knew it would come down to this <laughs> matchup. Arizona's defense having to win the football game, and Oregon's offense having to win the football game. All other phases, really, other than the, the uh, fumbled punt, have been negated. Yeah, Calamani just wasn't able to. He couldn't get, get off a good the ground. Jump there. They had too much penetration early. Well, now what do you do? Do you go over the top again, or do you roll Musgrave out with an option, or do you run some other kind of a running play in there? One thing is for sure, this will be the last play for the Oregon offense, right here. This is it. Dick Tomey and Rich Brooks. Great friends away from the football field. But right now, that friendship doesn't mean a thing. Musgrave, no, he didn't make it. Oh, man. Arizona. Oh, man. Stops the Ducks at the inch line. expected to be Daryl Lewis oh, man. to make the play of the game. Unbelievable. That's just a big collision down there. Bill looked like he was going to be able to get to the corner, but just didn't have, quite have enough foot speed. Daryl Lewis comes up with the big hit at the goal line to keep him out of there. You'll see right here, Bill's just going to roll out to his right. He's got the option. We've got a penalty against uh, Arizona, but I believe it's a dead ball penalty. They're going to move the football back to the half yard line. The only thing, the only thing that could lose this game for Arizona would be a fumble and a recovery by the Ducks in the end zone. Arizona can take a safety and win the football game. Oh, how demoralizing. How demoralizing. Well, you wonder the effect of Bill Musgrave's sprained ankle last night in practice had on his ability to run and get to the goal line. Unbelievable. What a tremendous football game. And it's going to be the Ducks. They say it's a game of inches. Never more evident than on fourth and goal from the one. Heartbreaking loss for the Ducks. A great win for Arizona. And if this is what the Pac-10 conference race is going to be like, <laughs> what a year. there are going to be a lot of coaches with a lot of gray hair. Oh, let me tell you. And you really 
could have been and might have been wasn't. They had their chance in the offensive line, and the, the Ducks' backs just couldn't quite get in the end zone. Let's see if they take the safety. Now they'll run it out, and that'll be the ball. That'll be it. Tough one in the desert. As the Arizona defense wins this football game, and if they got game balls, they ought to give them out to everybody on that defense because it was superlative and Oregon's come from behind effort comes up a foot short final score Arizona 22 the next 17